Hello everybody, my name is The Chef and welcome back to another Christmas countdown video. I believe we are on day five and uh, today's video we're going to be covering uh, Wano Law. Uh, now, um, the reason I chose Law and why I will be choosing other laws for these uh, this countdown is because Fa la 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 You know, it's kind of in the, the song. <laughs> I know it's cheesy, but whatever, fuck it, we're rolling with it. Uh, and I'm going to be doing these laws in uh, my particular favorite order of the three laws. Now, I know this might sound crazy, but you're saying, why, who the fuck in their right mind would think uh, or choose Wano Law as their favorite? Uh, that person would be me, because not only does he have the best room, and uh, that room is capable of uh, creating a debuff, but he is actually capable of hopping over this... Uh, this little waterway here, as you can see, a uh, really clutch move here on um, uh, Arlong Park. Uh, we see Mihawk over there trying to snipe us out. Uh, not a very friendly fella, if you ask me, but you know what? doesn't really matter to us. We're still going to capture this flag and hold it down here. Uh, I am running uh, Zone Grand Line and um, the Rumble set, so uh, that is NL. Um, Amaru NL and his uh, Cola NL medal all together. So he's getting a total of 15% extra damage reduction from those and a chance to sh uh, shock the enemy, which actually comes clutch when fighting enemies like Blackbeard, uh, Luchi, you know, uh, B B2 Kata, people that do multi hit attacks. Unfortunately, it won't work on Luffy, but uh, you know what? Luffy's a, Luffy's a fucking figgy pudding eating weirdo. So anyways, we, we ended up getting, uh, I think that was our Rayleigh taking out that Luffy with uh, the aid of us here. And this Mihawk over here is, uh, you know, trying to be a, a problem child, but, um, you know, we're just going to give him a lump of coal, which is the old shocker right there. And that move almost never lands. It is literally almost impossible to connect that attack. Uh, we are going to post up this room here. The room actually gives a uh, minus 30% attack and defense debuff for, I believe, 10 seconds, which is really, really nice. Um, maybe it's less than 10 seconds. I don't know what it is, but... Um, the debuff is really nice, especially against units like um, uh, a Rouge, for example, and this Rayleigh. Especially when he gets his like perfect dodge, you are taking away some of his uh, juice right there. Uh, we did see the Shanks just go over there and knock out those guys with his uh, ability, and uh, you know we're just gonna gaze upon our nice uh, Canada Goose jacket. We got the big old uh, walking stick, which is actually just a sword. We're just trying to you know put the, Im the wintry images in our head right here, uh, trying to you know fulfill the uh, holiday look. We actually landed this twice on that Mihawk, so, you know, thanks Mihawk for actually letting me land this attack, because it has never landed on anybody that I tried. And I played a shit ton of games. Uh, so, you can tell how, uh, we're, we actually are very tanky, especially when we're in our, our uh, uh, flag area here. We don't have like, um, you know, super tank uh, damage reduction um, potential because he is a step up unit, but uh, you know, with Grand Line and some damage reduction medals, he can actually be quite tanky. And I believe he does get a defense boost uh, with one of his traits as well. So we are switching into Snake Man because um, we don't want to lose this one. We have lost, uh, you know, 90% of our battles. Uh, <laughs> actually, no, I, I would say we lost like 60% of our battles with this uh, law. Um, not just be, not because he sucks, but just because you know the beginning of league is very, very, very um, unfriendly. Let's just say that it is a very uh, hostile environment at the beginning of a new season. Um, doesn't mean that the players are bad because they're an S plus or anything. It just means everybody has reset at the same time, and uh, you will be seeing a lot of EX units and stuff. So we actually got a W there, real nice. Um, 716 uh, points in lead, so not too bad right there. Let's uh, move on to the next one. Now, this one we could showcase a little bit more of his tankiness in, um, I have a little Royal Rumble over at the, either the D or the C. It is definitely the D, so <laughs> we'll get to that point in a second. This was like the latest match that I had. Um, you'll see this little Royal Rumble happening, and uh, by God. Um, I was pleasantly surprised. We're going to hang out with our fellow uh, Shichibukai, I guess ex-colleague, uh, Boa Hancock. She is a very, very powerful unit. I really wish I pulled on her. Uh, but instead, I ended up pulling my meat uh, and you know, not summoning on her. So, very, uh, very sad boy. Um, so, we do see a lone Sabo over there. So, I'm going to charge this up with the Boa Hancock and we're going to go jump that fool. 
Um, Boa Hancock is obviously like a, a nightmarish unit to go up against with her extremely high attack potential and the ability to uh, do entrance there. Now look at just tearing the Sabo into shreds. Uh, I do get the debuff on him, so it's a little bit easier for us to kill him as well. And uh, good job, Boa. You are a very, very solid lady. And you're making me solid in the pants right now. So we're just going to hold this down here. And uh, I believe Rayleigh is going to come try to jump us. And yes, indeed he is. Um, I think Boa Hancock took off on me to go protect the other flag, which is fine. Um, I actually managed to land this attack on Rayleigh, which is quite nice as well. Um, and there's another law here, the pretty, you know, the more handsome, stronger version of us. But, uh, you know, we're not going to let that uh, take away anything from our, you know, our self-love. you got to love yourself before you can love other people. So we're going to love ourselves real quick and actually chop up our, uh, our twin here. And look at us putting in all this work. It's fucking crazy. We actually got that kill on the Rayleigh. Knocked out that law. Uh, he's still alive and, uh, you know, he's still a huge threat. So um, we did get the kill on him, though. I was going to kill him, but the Sabo swept in and uh, took it from me. But no big deal. This is, uh, you know, whatever. doesn't matter. We just need to kill somebody. So I'm going to set up this uh, bubble here, this little Christmas bubble. If he jumps in here, he might get a little gift, a little stocking stuffer from yours truly. Uh, law Claws. It's like, no, that's kind of a shitty name. Let's, we're going to take that back. Somehow we have uh, five, we had five flags for a second, very uh, impressive. But uh, this, you know, because we weren't in our treasure area, we ended up getting killed by this uh, Sabo. You know how powerful Sabo is. Uh, easily one of the hardest units to counter in this whole game. Um, but we're going to wait for our uh, respawn here. Um, yeah, so again, I mean, everybody hates on this law. He is, he's not the best unit. He is, you know, it takes a lot of skill to use him, but uh, he can actually put in a little bit of work and he's quite tanky, so he does have some redeeming uh, qualities to him. Uh, almost landed the Gamma Knife there. Uh, didn't end up landing it. A Flame is just a terrible status effect to, to have, uh, you know, put on you when you're a defender because it just strains you below your HP threshold to get those uh, damage reduction perks. So. Uh, this is not the best fight for us here. Uh, we do have uh, our Sabo here uh, coming in a swoop in to save the day. Um, and he ends up killing the uh, other Sabo. So, unfortunately we couldn't get this one, uh, but not a big deal. We did uh, showcase how tanky this law can be. We got 5,399 points. Very, very solid number uh, for a unit like this. And, you know, most of the games I played, they were not too bad as well. So, anyways... Uh, with that, let's just go right to the uh, team support and medals. I'm actually super stoked for the reset, which is actually on this day um, that this video is going to be posted. I'm going to have some nice uh, medals going for that green law, and you'll see you'll see soon to complete the fa la 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 showcases. So, anyways, uh, that being said, uh, that's it for this video. If you guys liked the video, please like the video. Hit that subscribe button for more of this juicy, hot chocolate having, candy cane eating, figgy pudding loving, uh, turkey stuffing, one piece bounty rush content. And yeah, we'll see you in the next one. Peace.